Greetings from not the Citadel. He said that's okay. Hey, whose man's is this? He ain't about to be mine. That's <laughs> Look at that. I can skip the loading screen. Let's do that. Yes, please. Look at that, but no, he doesn't do it. Finder, is it true? He doesn't want anything We're about it. He doesn't want to, he doesn't want We've thought that, that before. Stop. I don't want to go home and... Now, right? Yeah. Pathfinder. Wait, punish <laughs> <my> stick? <laughs> Alright, come on, aid. come on, story. They all wanted to see you. Oh, Real there's only one again. story that's going on over it's here. It's a good day to party. It's a good day to party, yeah. Relax, yeah, Lieutenant. Party. Yeah, it's a good day to party in that 80s jumpsuit. Don't you want to look at my new, <laughs> yeah, my new <laughs> outfit? Finally yeah, back on yeah. Yeah. This is Herrick, your one of the clashing outfit. outfit. This is why you guys can't be on your lab. phones. Stop what looking at my phone. I'm not on my phone. It's difficult, okay? There you go. No, okay, I can't. I can't. Stop. Stop. We'll unravel those mysteries. The whole Nexus that will benefit. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like Photoshop. Get that out of here. No, it's true. It's not. She's really? she's that buff. <coughs> We've taken some hard I've seen videos of her. At, at least she doesn't look as bad again. as that one chick I had uh, anytime. Well, what are you waiting what for? What is with these There's clashing colors? Jesus Thank you. Christ. <laughs> to bother you. That's an abomination. You know exactly who I'm talking about when we were there, too. Hey, she was... Yeah, I, I mean, she can... That shit. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't you? She can she can scoop me up like I'm a bride. We can go into the back. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. She kind of had a butterface. All right. I mean that's fine. She probably did have a butterface. Everything's all fine and dandy as long as you don't turn around, you know. Still no glitch. I'm sorry. E. No. It's not yet. <clears throat> when they patched the game, they took out like half the entertainment value. You know. It was just a wackest thing. <laughs> Was running toward running towards that little elevator thing, and all of a sudden I fell through the level. I'm like, the fuck? Well, I, I don't know. I mean, um, do, do they still have that one scene where the uh, Asari points her gun at someone, and the gun itself is like backwards in her hand? We'll get there when we get there. <laughs> Patience. Well, don't make me do it. I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't pull the trigger if I were you. So, have we seen BioWare's new game, Anthem? Uh, I saw Blue Cross, someone Blue review Shield? the trailer for it. It does look interesting. Whoa! Hi! I'm just gonna... She just slid into position, if you know what I mean. I saw that. Well, I guess there is still a little bit of... Carrie to visit Freelance Bitmaker. This is Hakeem, my producer. I could use your help. What are you looking for? Director Towns asked for an uplifting documentary on the initiative. Translation, paint rainbows over our problems. But our problems are history. Do we have rainbows People in space? Is that truth, confirmed? Not propaganda. I mean, you know, that's the highest question <laughs> I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> <laughs> and I've smoked. That's the highest. That's that's an actual good question. What, are there are rainbows, rainbows in space? Is there a space a rainbow? Would that that's defy all it. laws of Sometimes science? The camera makes people shy I mean... Me. That's a shame. Ice? I mean, there is ice in so space. That's what I need. I'm not, I'm not. Ice is water, Someone needs to record. and it can, and it's reflected off of all of the sun's uh -huh. rays uh -huh. uh, I'm, everywhere. I'm googling space. <laughs> a crisis is Rain. the time for hope rather than hard truths. That was Tan's angle. But if we pretend everything's fine, who does that truly serve? They exist. The heart of my documentary what? will be an interview. Not series. like the in, in the in the, the, the typical the arch sense, story, not the but yeah, yeah not, there not, are not the whole Lucky Charms deal. No. There are rainbow colored nebulas okay. out there. Let's hey, if there, hey, if there's rainbows, you know the there's a leprechaun behind finished. it, right? Space Arts leprechauns? Missing, yeah. So it was le <laughs> leprechaun in space a plan. documentary in the making? Absolutely. It was ahead of its time. Would you agree? <laughs> I don't know about saying ahead of its time, but it was something. <laughs> if, if, if a space rainbow is on a galactic oh, scale a size, if you had to choose, imagine the pot of gold that it leads to. If you had to choose, would you rather really watch Leprechaun in Space or Leprechaun in the Hood? <laughs> I would probably rather watch Leprechaun in the Hood because it's comedic so value. Cool yes, yeah, so for the comedic value. I think no, I got. I got this. I'll read a book. <laughs> More fun than I oh, that wasn't a choice. <laughs> you agree? Yeah, I think I'll Leprechaun in Space might have taken itself a bit more seriously than Leprechaun in the Hood did. Or maybe who cares? You know, never mind. Never mind. Well, like uh, like Air Buds in Space. 
I like how I mentioned it and you just decide to Google image it. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm, I'm Biggie is the I'm only one on this phone. This is the actual story now. All right. Story Hello. time. Director Tan is expecting you. Last time I was here, this was a storage closet. Boring. Pathfinder Hall just needed a Pathfinder to open. We get a hall. Um, we get a full hall. Could you just take us one step back away from the cameras? He does have the camera like, like the phone. <laughs> it's like below his waist. He's looking at it, looking up at it. <laughs> you mean she? Oh shit. I have to go. My go go dancer is here. You're the hero of the hour. Yes, I am. I guess this is one bet that paid off. Point taken. Always revel in your victories. That's I don't like this guy so far. Here. I just don't like the way he talks or his voice at all. Did they have the female others. Solarians in the Mouch Effect 2? Of a prosperous future in Andromeda. Did they have female Solarians in Mass Effect 3? Yes. I hope you don't look at me at Is any that point. a yes with a question mark or a yes with a period? Yes, because one sounded feminine and said, this is my brother. I mean, could just be really flamboyant now, and Solarian. He had a head injury on, a mi on that mission, so he never went, yes, and this is my sister, because that dialogue never came up. Huh. I have never... I. Based on memory, I don't think I've encountered female Solarians. That didn't play three, so you know there's a lot of things. I suppose that, uh, we agree on that much. I knew that given a chance, your talents would emerge. Deciphering the vault, alien terraforming. It's not how we imagined all this, but a good Pathfinder <clears throat> improvises. And I know, a great you were talking a bunch of shit before I left. The wall. <laughs> <clears throat> they talk about you behind your back already. I thought you just made new friends. They hate you. Yours that much? Are the first trophy. I mean, just this they're, they're talking <coughs> shit to you, You're to your face, outrider. not behind your back. See, that's the, the real reason for, for my clashing deep. colors. So it hurts their eyes. Uh, yeah, yeah. The, so that um, make you a sight for sore eyes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> One of the uh, members of the council was a female Solarian. I mean, I, I see that, that existed since uh, Mass Effect One. No lasting effects on the memory that that character had. Yeah, it was I, I completely forgot about that character it. until I googled it. Careful, you'll end up adopting you, Ryder. Ah, my staff, colleagues, you wouldn't be looking to cut us out, would you, Tan? I remind you, I am the director of the initiative. Acting director. Damn, they just shit on him. This isn't the time for arguing over who gets to be king. Did she just Too much fly is at stake. Yeah, this she, is was, the she, she was a little high up and she kind of just That's dropped That's what I've been saying bit. since we were <laughs> <laughs> More. It's like, uh... It's like when you're waiting right. for a game to render and they just drop the character in place. Do as much good if the kid attack. That's but all this is. The <laughs> Improved research could help is this all just like one giant loading screen? It's all one giant render? Decision was made. So, is that female program a part of your on. team or no? What is your plan for moving? Fine team. We have a lead Will on the terraforming shoot network. Shit for I need to take the tempest okay. deeper into the sector to investigate. If the other golden worlds are where they should be, this could get us closer to them. Careful. The Ked are scouring the cluster for remnant technology. Do you, You'll end up in a do you fight think for sure. people would be ready you for a female program in your team? They didn't leave the Nexus on good terms. Um, and define what outlooks. you mean. They're important to expanding the You station. know what I mean. Though with Ark still missing, I do not have the chance for Ryder to search for them. I think. Yes, I think <laughs> that's best. You have my permission. If the female Krogan was ready, they don't have a choice. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Does that answer you your like question? Sure. Snoo, snoo, no. <laughs> Wait, can't are Krogan's right. capable of having safe sex with humans? They will I have think safe sex with Asari, I so think yes. this, the question is, are humans capable of having <laughs> safe <laughs> sex with a Krogan? Did I open up a box of worms, put it away. No. Nope. Um, I think you opened up a box of worm, and <laughs> it would like to be put away, but the female well, Krogan said otherwise. <laughs> oh, man. Can't we just cuddle? It's not barbed, but it will do. As soon as possible. Right. Something about environmental viability and perks. Could be useful. Why? You, you started it. There's no ending it now. There's no end in sight. Like that Krogan. 
man, it's like a locked spaceship. <laughs> you gotta try and cut past me. Or you can hit that eject button Hi, and go into that plasma nebula. Do you think they both... Which one is it? I think they, <laughs> think they both just... I uh, <laughs> think they both just go at it until one of them dies. You mean until the human dies? <laughs> We'll okay. just have some me some meta gel on standby. What, what are those What are those things called that Krogan fight? What are they? The, the big worm things? Oh shit! Thresher Mars. Yeah. Thresher Ma. Fucking Krogans fight Thresher Mars. You think they can hold a grown ass man down with one finger? <laughs> have you seen a Thresher Ball? It's the size of this house and then some. So like SpongeBob, ah. that, that Alaskan bullworm. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they fucking fight Alaskan bullworms. <laughs> Okay, so now we have Dr. <coughs> Addison. Up, that was part of the main thing. My department actually has colonial My face hurts. It really and you does. Have new tools and my eyes can't focus on you, only sometimes. AVP. What's about the ceiling? Spending? Is this how lips work? That's, a, that's where she was looking. She's talking, and her eyes are looking Sam up. Sam the said whole there time. was a new functionality to discuss. <laughs> it's how <laughs> the initiative was designed to support the Pathfinder. <laughs> you and your team are out there making Andromeda viable. That empowers all of us. Yay! A new cryo group can be brought out. Yay, Want more focus yay. on research, like on Prodromos? That's your call. Brecker will introduce the interface and handle minutia. It's like everything from her do nose is down is like Andromeda fluid. Pressure. No pressure. <laughs> Make it sound like it's just one Krogan versus the whole thing. <laughs> Shit, for all we know it is. No, they use Krantz. What is it, Krantz? Basically. The squad. <laughs> Krogas will be That was Mass around. Effect 2. Look, alright, I don't play the games to the same extent that you did, okay? I played through the games once, I got my stroke, and I left. I didn't replay it. Shame on you, sir. Foyly a Russian character. Pasvidanya. <laughs> You're kidding? Yes, of course. But now I'm not romantic. Shame on and nexus thresholds are your tools You are not ready for a relationship with me. How can I help? <laughs> what are these points? What's the rundown on AVP. <laughs> Much of the preparation in the Milky Way was determining how to measure success. Thresholds are about capacity, but this is about cost. What we can actually afford to support. Points aren't the most elegant system, but it makes it clear. The more you earn, the more we can deploy. <laughs> Wait, did he just say he doesn't understand How this point you system? You know what, never mind. It's based on resource <laughs> estimates and general stability. What I'm entirely sure how this point system works. The more you achieve, the greater capacity we can accommodate, the more the initiative can do for you. Simplest explanation? Wow, you put the, more the distraction you do, away. The more <gasps> I'm impressed. The Dharma I I initiative? <laughs> Waking so I people decide up. what groups to wake up. Won't everyone be out eventually? No. Absolutely. But there's an order. <laughs> you don't get to max out your stats. There will be. You can't deploy an there's gonna be several hundred people that never get woken up. And eggs won't get you steak. What the hell? Um, people. eggs will get How you steak because it's called trade. <laughs> You dumb bitch. Or if you don't eat your meat, you can't have any pudding. All right, Brecca. Where do I start? You can't have any pudding without them the eggs. And will respond only to a pathfinder. There is no trade in Russia. Solution. You get, you you're happy. You don't get, you're still happy. You know, eat steak and eggs. Steak and eggs eat you. In this in this galaxy, I'm sure it does. Probably. That would be that would be kind of messed up if you landed on a planet and the, Ooh, and the research points. I'm sure I bet the be vegans helpful. will have a field day with that. And it was like food that fought back. <laughs> well, when they say the steak is a little tough, I didn't mean this. <laughs> How's that steak treating you? <laughs> it's got a mean left. <laughs> <laughs> it's leaving me a bit raw. Raw high. You get out there. This meat's giving me a pounding. Eat. <laughs> didn't do that intentionally, did he? I'm Are pretty you? sure he did. Alright, round two? Okay, I can only go for three, though. <sighs> cut the comms. <laughs> what if he needs help? Just, just cut the comms. 
Okay, so the, uh, if I remember correctly, the doc needs to see us about about my brother. My brother! My baby brother! You get the space plague? They're twins. I know. Or is the space plague another uh, Mass Effect game? There's a lot of space Mass, I think that was Mass Effect 2. <laughs> okay. That was that recruiting mission. So nobody has the itis anymore, right? Uh, I mean, itis? I'm just tired because I did work all day. You over to the Nexus. You'll need to clear did your outfit front. just change color all of a sudden? Or was it always that color? <laughs> it's, it's, al it's, al <laughs> it's always been that ugly. No, it look, the, the blue looked white before. You look like a gay slave owner from Django. Oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm Nigel McCoy. I'm and pretty sure it's because <laughs> she's in a less lighted area. Shit, Nigel. he's already discovered what the initiative is really about. It's bittersweet <laughs> slavery. My little brother Dash was stationed on the Nexus. I just learned he died on Eos, trying to start a settlement. Whoops. That's awful. I'm sorry, Nigel. Yeah. We were gonna start families out here together. That was I the worst sniff. It was. <laughs> we're gonna start families. Will you I like how he didn't even move. Will like, his like head moves. Of course. He could have at least, like, moved his arm or something like that. They wasted all the budget on these colors. Apparently. At least lose the scarf. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> I don't get to choose that. <laughs> like, nobody else gets to wear a scarf. Well, we got we brought enough scarves for everyone. I don't want to get your hopes up, but Sam managed to uh, find him, you might say. So what do you think of that uh, Super Mario get, uh, Odyssey coming up? Well, he's still in a coma. It's going to be but good. Also has when was the last time Mario game was released? It was bad. And Sam managed to access it. Golf? He's made contact. Hold on. You think Mario Golf wasn't fun? Fuck out of here. It was pretty fun. I don't think I knew anybody who actually had it, so... I had it. I still have it. So you have I was gonna say... So now you know. He's okay? I was gonna say, I wasn't here in fucking elementary school. I'm back in Hammond. Sam take the lead on this one. Dick. They're in a coma. Scott's mental well, processes you know. remain intact. Dick. So is he okay? Bad Mario game. You can ask mm. him yourself. A moment while I establish a link is implant. Proceed. I don't know, What'd you do to him, Sam? Why did he jerk like that? I don't know. Can Mario and Sonic me? at the Olympic Games? I said Mario games. Is that you? <laughs> uh, technically, that was also a Sonic you. game, so that's What's why it was bad. There was a he speaks! He speaks! <laughs> You're in a coma on the Hyperion. Do you understand? See, space, wow. space gives really? us the technology to speak to people oh. in a coma. Sam linked into your implant, but they say you're stable. You're safe and sound in the med bay. Guess I'll take your word for it. I can't feel anything, but I still hear you. Is that okay? That would, that he would died. Be... Oh man. I'm not sure how to say this, but he's, he's dead. dead. Scott. Jim. I mean what? Scott. There was an accident. You accident? How? I mean, Dad. I know. It was all very sudden. That's why anyone could it do. It would have been more realistic if right know. after you told him he was sure in a, a coma, he was like, he would just go. Did we ah! I think more realistic just, if he just said, "Okay, well, leave out. Just kind of leave me alone. I need a minute." Or if he, or if he said, "Well, let me wake up," and he just opens his eyes. He's like, "Hold on, hold on, hold on." He's like, "What?" <laughs> What, telling someone that they're in a coma in this method and they just wake out of it? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> the hell? I didn't realize that worked like that. See it. It's amazing. Even better than the hype. I hope Dad got to see it. He, he got to see a death world. I should be with you now. We're going to be supportive. You were never one to quit, little brother. A nap won't hold you back. Yeah. Apparently, this nap so. is holding him Dad back. To push on. So would mom. Yeah, yeah. was it like 600 Wherever years? Yeah. I'm actually I jealous. I want a nap like this. For, for, for like a week or two. What happened? Space the nap. Was only temporary. Yeah. His condition remains like stable. a mini coma, you know. Space nap or snap? Sorry. <laughs> Seems better than nothing. Yeah, kids call it I'll keep you posted. Snap. Promise. Thanks, Harry. <clears throat> So I had the 
unfortunate pleasure of seeing a very shitty movie. It was, was, was that the horror movie you were like, oh, everybody said it was good? Yeah. Oh, uh, the movie is called It, it Comes, Comes at, at Night. night. Continue. Yes. That was two and a half hours of not a fucking thing. <laughs> The like, whole movie, you not, know, just, not just half of it. You know all the boring exposition parts in like any zombie movie or any movie about a plague or whatever. Yeah. It was two and a half hours of boring exposition. I mean, like going to chop firewood, talking about nothing, uh, talking about feelings. You want to know the worst part? Stupid feelings. You paid money for that. that is, <laughs> <laughs> the worst. The worst part is I sat through the whole movie because I could have left at any point in time. That is true. That movie was priority. A steaming hot pile of buzz ass. It was terrible. Aren't you glad? Aren't you glad you went to go see that instead of hang out with your friends? I did. <laughs> I did. I did both actually. So <laughs> I saw Wonder Woman last week. That was a good movie, though. It was. I had to leave at the very end because I had to go to work. Fuck work. Awkward. What are they going to do with you being late for one time? Fire you? No, but right then. I, I didn't want to be late. You paid money for a movie and you didn't see it to the end. I would have been late. I, I had friends. Uh, I was watching it with friends and uh, they, they, they told me like uh, how it ended. Like I figured I knew how it ended, but just to be sure. Did we all see Wonder Woman? No. Of course. Well, to be as vague. <laughs> well, to be oh, vague. This guy's like, sorry, guys. Did we all have the same reaction when we saw Ares? Yeah. Because my reaction was, oh, that's Ares? Alright. What does he really look like? And then it just showed the guy with this chiseled ass body with the same face. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that's Ares! He looks like a fucking bond villain. <laughs> looks like Benny Hill and shit. But then when he put the armor on, it was amazing. So we have a stowaway. Because you couldn't see his face. You mean PB? It, yeah. It, it was just. He's nice. decided to set up in one of the escape pods. Just you don't need a psychologist right. to tell you that one. I was, I was one waiting for something a little more. Oh my god. A little more legendary. Okay. You know, or something. We'll go through uh, those dialogue like options a different day. It. I'll be here if you need me. I also don't care for the way the movie concluded with, um... Everyone well, humans suck? Uh, well... Are we talking about it comes at night or Wonder Woman? Wonder Woman. Hold on. I can, I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. How she, like, lucked out to go thwart evil, right? Because of that? Let me see. Oh. That's a really? Thing. That's a thing now? That's how it, that's how it ended. That, God damn. It was like, oh, well, where is this? Because I have the power. Oh, we do. We anime now. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. She's floating. Oh, yikes! Oh, are you oh, sure? Vetra. What do you mean? Are you sure? Oh yeah, yeah. She's yeah, floating. She is. She Look is. at that. Talk to Vetra. Hi. Teach me. How do you float like that? I've been watching Chris Angel hollow vids. <laughs> right. We really had no idea what he was Murder bubbles? About, I thought we? we had a smoke cloud following us. You know, if at any point in time in my life I decide to play this game, that's when I'm going to smash the first time I play it. <laughs> right there. Just the packing alone. <laughs> point taken. You want to smash I'm a uh, humanoid cricket? I really hope you have. I one. mean. <laughs> In, retro in retrospect, I played one and two. I mean, I, I smashed a human. I smashed a blue bitch. I smashed a bitch in, a, in an exosuit. I mean, what's next? That's only the next. That's Where's the next logical choice right there. You're, you're just trying to broaden your Wherever horizons, I see. I mean, I, I have to taste all the fruit on the table, you know? <laughs> I mean, we have to make the alternative as bad as that movie you watched. Not even worth thinking about. You never know until you try to find the hole and then cut your dick off. Does she chirp? <laughs> You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. I don't even know what to say to that. Now, what if if d <laughs> during it you think you're hot shit and then in, off in the distance you just hear crickets okay, chir chirping? 
No, no, no. You're, you're, like she says, meet me in your corner, and you're, you're going out there. I hear it. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that somebody's uh, cell phone? Vetra, is, is, is that you? Come in. <laughs> oh my god. How are you making that sound? It's the sound we make when we're aroused. <laughs> are you going to make that sound the entire way through? Is that a problem? <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know, where we come from, that means we're not something drunk. But I'll, I'll work through it. I'm a professional. Okay. Let's go.